okay so in this video uh, i'll show you how can we have our regular tours on cabinets and just extend the ends both ends by 50 millimeters and have an extra lip here is a panel by you know 50 millimeters so in this case suppose if i hide doors see okay so this is extra lip here and the doors ends as usual at the base you can see here it ends here here at the base you can see from left see this is our bottom panel and doors ends here with some gap and we have extra lip here so for doing that we can show you how we can do that <coughs> I'll have a copy of this paste okay and we'll just remove my settings okay I'll have a no we'll have a a fresh cabinet here just drag a fresh cabinet so our wall cabinet two pairs here okay so see I have this cabinet this is our regular wall cabinet with uh, see doors usual doors and usual ends so what I want I want to extend these doors bottom no i don't want to extend actually i want extra panel here is a 50 millimeter and I just want to extend the ends so if i want the height of this extra panel 50 millimeters so what we will do we will we can just or we will we will just do this we will select this product and click edit and we can we will try to shift we will try to move the bottom first upwards by 50 millimeters okay so doing that for to do that go to go in this interior and then adjust case and the bottom interior scribe make it 50 see if i make it 50 it comes down but i want it to be up so i'll go again and make it minus 50 correct so now our bottom panel is upwards so in the next we will delete this for now and we have the this face right I'll select this as a open okay I want doors here up to this bottom as usual and extra lips here as a panel so I will divide this open space into two parts okay so select this select this uh, by going into face this space and click the grid and divide into two parts open okay click okay now it's divided in two parts now select this one and make height at 50 okay now height is 50 and it's open so change its type to panel okay see the bottom lip is applied see so led can be hidden and we want door here as usual so just select this space now this one and just select this as a pair see the pair door here as usual doors with some gaps you can see here see with some gaps with this panel and we have extra lips bottom upwards so led can be mounted in the bottom LED can be mounted and it will be permanently hidden with this uh, fixed panel okay extra panels and we have already extended this uh, not extended 
uh, we already moved this bottom upwards so no need to extend these uh, unfinished ends so it's looking looking good right okay so these are the ways we can uh, modify the upper cabinets in order to hide leds hope you got the idea and you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the video like it share it comment please comment down uh, your comments boosts our morals and we it's give us energy to keep making such videos so don't forget to comment and share okay so anyhow uh, th these are the ways see what i have done i just moved the bottom up and so i no need to extend the ends if i do not moving bottom up so i may need to extend the ends for that you can just select the ends and adjust by bottom increase the bottom by 50 mil so these are two ways that i shown you how we can extend the end panels and doors in order to hide the leds so hope you enjoyed the video thank you okay so in the same cabinet in this one where we have added extra leaps uh, see these ends are unfinished ends and we can see the screws here but suppose if you want it to be a finished end so we can just click this and select here from finished ends both okay so we want finished end as a suppose we want these finished ends as a applied doors extra panel so we can just select keep selecting this and go to here parameter overrides and ends and just select here here doors on finished ends is applied doors okay now so extra doors has been appeared so this is one case right so you can see like this okay so now uh, the screws are hidden okay but suppose we want these unfinished uh, panels to be as a regular up to the bottom what we can do we can just keep selecting this and have it as a none first okay then go to edit and have our go to shape and go select this unfinished end first and and select the bottom and keep make it minus 50 because we have extend we have moved our bottom upwards by 50 millimeter so minus 50 see like this similarly this one bottom minus 50 okay right but it doesn't look good right i think it should be kept extended or if you want this configuration then uh, we ca we have to <laughs> reduce uh, this uh, back also from bottom by minus 50 okay so now it's like this so it's like this now so this is our regular wall cabinet this is our regular wall cabinet with these loops okay and now we just want the finished ends extra finished ends to be uh, applied there so we will select this and have it finished ends both okay now let's see how it looks it looks perfect see we have our regular cabinet here with extra lips and the finished ends extended huh? right perfect so this is third way that uh, we can adjust our finished ends and uh, add some extra panels here in order to hide the leds at the bottom 
thank you. If you like this video, please subscribe, press the bell icon to get the instant notifications of the upload. I'll keep uploading trainings, tutorials, videos for the CAD packages. So keep watching. Stay tuned. Thank you.